Hello, my dear cat lovers. Recently, my friend asked me to take care of her dog while she was away. So I started researching how to make an adult cat and dog who are used to being alone get along. I'd like to share what I found with you. First, I learned that it's often easier to make a cat and dog get along than two cats. Interspecies aggression in cats is stronger than interspecies aggression. Although dogs are natural enemies of cats, a cat that hasn't had negative experiences with dogs is more likely to bond with a calm dog than with another cat. The first and most important thing is that the original resident should get the majority of the territory and the newcomer should get less. For example, if you already have a cat and bring in a dog, the cat should receive more attention. This can be difficult because the newcomer also needs care, but it's essential to maintain balance and give the original resident at least half of your personal attention. When introducing a new pet, the cat must not be restrained or confined. The cat should have the choice to interact or not, and at what distance. With a dog, it's the opposite. A socialized dog feels more confident on a leash. It's safest to start introducing the dog while it's on a leash or in a crate. When you bring the new pet home, give it a separate room where it can stay for the first few days. Try to build a relationship with the new pet and ensure you can control it before introducing it to the resident animals. Don't rush to introduce the newcomer immediately. Meanwhile, the resident pets will get used to the new scent and sounds from behind the door. Scent exchange. After a few days, start a scent exchange. Use socks to pet the dog first, then the cat. Let them sniff each other's scent. If the cat sniffs calmly, reward it with a treat. This stage is complete when the cat no longer reacts negatively to the scent. Room exchange. Allow the cat to explore the dog's territory when the dog is away. The cat needs to become familiar with the dog's scent in a calm environment. Visual introduction. Once the pets are calm and no longer stressed by the presence of a new animal, move on to visual introductions. Keep the dog on a leash or in a crate and let the cat enter the room. Stay still and let the cat decide what to do. Always allow the cat an escape route and a way to climb to higher ground. Reward both the cat and the dog for calm behavior. Conduct short, about five minutes, sessions several times a day, allowing the cat to set the pace for getting closer. When the cat becomes comfortable and starts approaching more closely, you can begin to allow the dog to move on the leash or let it out of the crate. Overall, from my experience, I want to say that this is a very time-consuming process. In my case, after two weeks, we had just reached the first visual introduction, and the cat started to accept the dog. But then my friend returned and took the dog back home. Interestingly, now when the cat sees the dog, she accepts it calmly. So my methods did work, and the cat accepted the dog. I hope this video helps you too in getting your cat and dog to become friends. I'd be glad if you subscribe to my channel and like this video. Thanks for watching.